Bro. What's going on? Ah! Yeah, I got cans again, guys. It's fine. Yeah, I got cans again. You know, I thought game development had gone too far when they made the other colon game, and then they made a real colon game, and now there's just an actual fucking, like, more than an hour long is, like, the... Is, Guys, this isn't like a fucking five minute game. This is like a this is like a stream. <laughs> How long is this colon? New <laughs> Twitch TLS is wild. I don't know if this is following the meta, guys. Everything you see here is absolutely allowed. Colonoscopy meta. Yeah. Variety streamer. <laughs> Guys, once a year I have to engage in pure, absolute variety by also grabbing a disgusting, nasty game. Last year was Urge, this time it's Revenge of the Colon. It's part of the variety cycle. Guys, they added new content to Pumping Simulator, guys. I know that I know that this is like a bad time to bring it up during the freaking colonoscopy stream, but they added they added marijuana growing to Pumping Simulator. When will that game actually focus on the game that it was named after? Tomato Google Boofing. Mods, ban that guy for life. Don't ever tell me what to do. <laughs> I'll have you know, I unfortunately already know what that is. Guys, stop asking me about boofing. Stop asking me about boofing. Stop talking about boofing. Dude, it just sucks because nowadays, literally everything I say is disgusting <laughs> and perverted. And most of the time, I don't even know. Bro, do not talk about sprinkling. What the fuck are you talking? Dude, I need an entire fucking like, uh, like. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, chat. I, I need to actually, I think, just have a blanket ban on phrase of bro do not talk about and then insert any word here because I don't know what the fuck is or isn't anything and now you're scaring me. Don't tell this dude about schlonking. What the f Urban Dictionary. Schlonking. The act of smoking, eating, or otherwise consuming low to, low to mid grade marijuana. It's got zero upvotes and zero downvotes. Wait, wait, why is that the top response then? Wait, 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 wait. What the fuck is this site? <laughs> okay, schlonk. Guys, the most up vi the All right, we got it, guys. Definition of the word schlonk. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, hang on. Verb to do anything. Okay, that's... Well, then that's nothing. <laughs> Then I'm afraid, Vladimir Schlonkingberry, who posted this on February 3rd of 2019. Schlonking is a lifestyle choice, a way to express how much better you are than any person who doesn't schlonk the same way you do. I want to punch this guy in the fucking nose. <laughs> Rick and Morty terms. <laughs> it's just, it just doesn't mean anything. Use it as a replacement for any verb in the hopes that more individuals realize the importance of gang schlank. Did, did in the definition did it just say the only way that this definition ever works is if everyone uses it? So please God help me, help me schlank. Fifty three people bought it. Fifty three people upvoted this and were like, yeah, I'm gonna tell people to schlank. The crypto love slang. This is, we have got a actual cryptocurrency slang here, guys. <laughs> it's real. I mean, it's like the def, the actual usages of, of, of schlonkin are really confusing and bad too. Vladimir put all these in. Yo, anyway, man, I was schlonkin Margaritaville up in loft and I mean real bull hours. And it's like, what the, I don't understand what half that meant anyways. Uh, the next one is, you put that shit on schlank also doesn't mean anything because you said it was a verb, motherfucker. Vladimir, you said it was a verb. What do you mean? You put, what do you mean? Making verbs into nouns, are we, Vlad? Doesn't know what it is. Uh, hell yeah, man. I schlanked that fucker half to death. We can no longer use the word schlank. I cannot help but feel like Vladimir has mislabeled this verb because I don't like anyone saying that they schlonked anyone half to death, guys. Schlonking might be a nasty boy term. I'm just so tired of nasty boy terms, guys. Let's stop schlonking and start praising. Can I get an amen? Amen! 
We all can amen to that. L literally, the guy who you... Hang on. I'm scrolling to the next definition of schlunk. I choose not to... Sub I'm giving Vladimir Schlunkenberry's definition a down vote. Schlunking is the act of smoking weed while shitting and having an orgasm at the same time. All right. So I'm going back up to Vladimir Schlunkenberry. <laughs> I'm going back up, guys. Retreat. Okay, okay. Hang on. The third... There's more... Guys, there's like a dozen fucking definitions. People have been fighting tooth and nail for their definition of schlonk to be the ultimate definition. <laughs> I can't read this. I can't read this one. Uh, the, schlonking. The act of a woman watching in horror as the man with a toothpaste tube in his bunghole and chip clips on his nipples angrily slaps his meat either backhanding or just open hand slap by Andy Buttmuncher6969, December 1st, 2016. Is this artistic nudity? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing this thing where my artistic nudity is reading the nastiest Urban Dictionary definitions live on stream with a picture of uh, a freaking 3D rendered colon from a horror video game uh, as my backdrop. Ugh, men, am I right? For what? For what? What am I apologizing for? What do you mean? I don't know. No Merry Christmas. No Muppets. Crazy. Look, I'm sorry I didn't say Merry Christmas to anyone. However, what I won't apologize for is, um, at any point not watching The Muppets. I just do not fucking care. There it is, dude! I finally was brave enough to say it! Look at that awful message you sent me. I'm crying. Oh my god, I'm so- Dude! This was so true of me to say, dude. Holy shit. I should have copied and pasted this again this year. I called her support. <laughs> Damn! This year I didn't even say Merry Christmas. I wasn't! I wasn't! Dude, I finally, for once, like, was like, I'm not gonna look at anything. I got out of there. Don't, bro, don't look up support on Urban Dictionary. Oh, mega lol. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I just caught, I just got caught out using some bad lingo, guys, live with screen caps. Oh, fuck. You are a gastroenterologist, a specialized doctor with expertise in diagnosing and treating diseases of the digestive tract. One of the most common procedures you perform is the colonoscopy. You are well respected among your peers and a regular speaker at all the important annual colonoscopy conferences. There's many important annual colonoscopy conferences, Chad. Many. You have seen it all and treated it all. Nothing phases you. There is nothing you cannot handle. You are the Michael Jordan of gastroenterology. All right, game, relax. Relax. You do not know it yet, but this is your final week. Oh, what the fuck is that? What is this loading screen? No, it don't matter. It has been nearly 70 years since I have been on holiday abroad. After we arrived in Calais, we were waiting in line and I saw a horrid expression on the guard's face. It gave me such a fright that I took off my wedding ring and swallowed it. Why is there a shit stain on the fucking bench? No, 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 no. Why didn't he clean it? Hang on, this guy's supposed to be the Michael Jordan of colonoscopies. What the hell? Well, it's quite likely that the ring did not leave your body. Or the ring did leave your body and you simply did not see it. No, I'm quite sure it has not come out. Oh, Mima, what the hell? My husband, Harold, has much better eyesight than I have and he has done all the searching. I don't want to know. I don't need to know that. <laughs> Harold, you nasty fuck. I'll give you a moment to get into position and then we shall begin. Oh, we're doing this one live? We're not doing like, a, we're not pre-planning this one for later. This isn't a future like appointment. This is, we're doing this one live. I got a quick 30 seconds. I quick in and out, grab it, and we're done here. All right, I'm in. Oh! Sorry to anyone chat who had to see that. I got bad news. You all just saw some asshole. <laughs> a tool for pulling objects free that are stuck on or pierced into the colon. Ah, it's a full simulation. Not just to go through the tunnel. This is a full simulation. Scans parts of the, the healthy section of colon. No treatment required. Copy that. We got the grabber. Yeah. 
Yep, that there's uh, that there healthy colon right there. No doubt in my mind. Fucking <laughs> smacking it around. Oh, uh, here we have the cutter. High powered, high precision surgical cutting device. Yep. Ah. Uh, get the fuck out of there. What? The oh, what the? Mima, what the hell is going on in here? This is the worst stream ever. Dude. Oh! Hang on. Hold, hold up. Which one of these? Which one? Of, hang on. We're good. It's going to be fine. We'll, we'll wash it all out and uh, we'll, we'll have the freaking. We'll have an intern sift through it to find the one that I actually want to analyze. We don't need Avis. No bull, just that one spot on the bed. Oh, quiet, you. I'm in a new zone. Yup, same as the last. Stop pinching it. I'm just checking to see if it's freaking normal or if something wrong is gonna happen, all right? Ain't nothing wrong with, ain't nothing wrong with checking, all right? And I got news for you. Yup, that's, that's Colin. Dude, it's just, it's just, how the fucking far, how far in do I have to go to get this freaking ring? Where the hell is this thing? What the fuck is that? Guys, it didn't do anything. Why is Geodude here? Asks a chat member. What the? Okay. There we go. It's susceptible to lasers, guys. Are you even a doctor? Guys, I'm not just a doctor. I'm an artist. All right? I'm the Michael B. Jordan of fucking colonoscopies. All right? People come to me. They pay extra. All right? I'm one of the best. Can I actually... Hang on. Can I actually, like... Boom. <laughs> a Jewish smile. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm having a little bit. I'm getting a little creative, guys. Um, I'm getting a little bit creative because I'm a fucking professional. He's 76. I don't care. Piece of sweet corn. You found this in thousands of patients over the years. Did I, look, dude, did my guy like, here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing. When you get a colonoscopy, they make you drink that nasty, horrible juice so you fucking get rid of all this. My dude was just like, we're going in right now. I don't have time to wait. I'm the Michael B. Jordan of colonoscopies. I'm doing it now. <laughs> I'm fucking freestyling it. Quick 20 minute in and out colon session. That's exactly how I think I think that's actually how it is. Ideally, the doc isn't just adventuring in your ass for hours, but there's so much to see. Look at all this stuff in here. <laughs> Guys, you could spend, you could spend freaking years adventuring in a place like this. Look around you. Hang on, I need a saw. Wait, 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 no, I need a laser. Get rid of these, get rid of that, get rid of this. Is that teeth? Chat, what the fuck is that? Is that someone's? Is that dentures? What the fuck is this lady's problem? Oh my god. The patient might want this back. No, they're fucking not. They're not gonna want that back. They're not gonna want their two front teeth back from the dentures that tragically they swallowed. What did Katie say? What did you fucking say? Harold Eaton ass hot face. The nasty, horrible face. Katie will do this thing where they always act like they're. Like, they, like, they're not one of the nasty ones. And then when I'm not looking and they think they can get away with it, they'll say the worst shit. Guys, I hear the thing. Colin doesn't go forever. Eventually, you get to small intestine. There can't be much more of this, guys. Oh, my God. There it is. The ring. An ancient piece of chewing gum, per chewing gum permanently stuck to the colon. And this is why you don't eat gum. My fucking God. The thing is goddamn stuck to the... Got it. After you rinsed off Mrs. Hargreaves' ring, you watched with delight as she slid it back onto her finger. And then, and then put back on her dentures mm -hmm, and asked where her gum was. You went to bed chuckling to yourself until you fell asleep, feeling happy. This was the last normal day. Okay, so they gave- That was normal? It was uncommon for someone as young as you to require a colonoscopy. When I saw your x-ray, I was quite shocked. I could not distinguish what was happening inside your large intestine. For every year, I would eat the eraser at the end of my pencils. 
Then, and I would eat small bits of paper or small bits of plastic from food packaging. Recently, I began to crave metallic items and I began eating small coins, paper clips, small screws, and steel nails. Then doctors referred me to you. Well, it's a good thing they referred you to me because I'm the- uh, If you didn't know, I'm like the Michael B. Jordan of colonoscopies. I'm like- I, I, I'm I'm actually fucking crazy. I'm insane. We will do things slowly and methodically and carefully remove all the remaining objects from your barrel. I'm like the Jesus of gastroenterology, lady. You have nothing to worry about. I'm about to freaking absolutely save you. Don't worry. Any money I find in here is mine to keep, by the way. All right, that goes to the doctor's fees. All right, she's barely gonna be able to afford this to begin with. We keep the fucking change. I'll tell you that. Yep, these gold doubloons. Yeah, no, those are mine. Doctors get to keep any loot found in the dungeon. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? A steel nail. Dude, all I'm gonna say is I better not run into a freaking little goblin with a hammer in here that tries to beat the shit out of my camera because this thing's expensive. That's, that's going into the bill for the fucking patient. There's like a creature in here. You don't want to hear your doctor at the colonoscopy saying that, like, going in and out of consciousness, you just hear something, like, midway through freaking like, getting zonked out on the freaking like, freaking gas, and you just hear the guy say, there better not be something in there with this fucking camera. Who the hell is that? What's that? Who's that little guy? Why does this colon look like a hardware store? Uh, because the uh, person ate a hardware store, essentially. What if you use the cutter on the nails? Yeah, let me carve these things out. Ah! That's not gonna cut it. Pop. 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 Come on, Pop. <laughs> That'd be actually the, the Michael B. Jordan of colonoscopies. You fucking show up in that place. You fucking, you wake up and there's a fucking ball of popcorn next to you. Oh, could you fucking imagine though? Still fairly normal. Run of the mill. That was a normal Tuesday. Flowing into the safety pits. Yeah, and into the popcorn I made. They asked, they put, they brought us up to there on day two of five. Five nights in colon. <laughs> I've been a fisherman for almost 17 years. Every day I go out to sea and return with what nature gives me. Everything I eat comes from the sea. I feel hungry all the time, even after eating a big meal. No, 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 and I'm losing a lot of weight, which scares me the most. Make yourself comfortable. I'm going in. Okay, no, no. He said, and we shall begin. If the doctor said, make yourself comfortable, I'm going in. Uh, I, I wouldn't want to be there anymore. <laughs> I'm going in. Puts on helmet. Uh, we're going in. I got to put my safety gear on. Nurse, get the shrink ray. Guys, after the last mission, I've decided to increase my tech. I've shrink rayed myself into the colon. Oh, what the fuck is that? Uh, I mean, I'm, uh, I mean, everything's fine, patient. Everything's fine. There's nothing. You just, t you just keep on focusing on, uh, you. No, everyone, stay calm. S looks like some kind of unidentified aquatic blood-sucking tick. Kill it and flush it out. I don't want if it attacks me. Hey, hey, get the fuck off that thing. Stop it. Get the fuck off of him. All right, catch it. I'm pulling out the laser. Die, freak! Couldn't you just take anti-parasite medication? Well, yeah, but Chad, there's not a Michael B. Jordan of anti-parasite medications, all right? You pay for the experience. Give me a fucking break. Doom internal. <laughs> Come on, dude. That's just a rough message. I just don't like reading that. At Tomato, I hope all the steak you ever eat is well done. What the fuck? This might be the worst game you have ever played. You really mean that? Oh, guys, he really means that. Let's explore. <laughs> you guys can't, you guys have to remember that like after this game, the context of some of your messages are going to be gone and it's going to be the worst messages you ever. Played. So like, remember that too. Also, this sucks in here. This is bad. This is the worst Magic School Plus episode. Hey, get down from there. So, uh, what have we here? Just a couple potatoes. Just a couple healthy potatoes. 
See, the good thing is, I'm not really here. Like, I'm on the exterior watching this shit happen, so it's not actually that bad. You better wash your hands. I need to also be clear, my hands aren't in here. This is a freaking robot cre- Like, it's a- it's a hose thing. It's like what this tool is. You are entirely in there. Maybe in your sick, disgusting head cannon, but not in real life. Wearing this poor fisherman like a puppet. The doc- <laughs> Little does he know this man has been dead on the table for hours. The doctor is gonna be shocked once he pulls his head out of his head. Guys, my character's head is not in his ass. That's not how this procedure works. Sekiro Carp Fight. What are you talking about? Piano and Chess 33, a new chat member, says hi. Hey, come, come on in. Come on in. Have a seat. Sit down right here. We're playing this horror game where we're in some kind of weird tunnel. Are you sure you're working on a human? Well, I'll, I'll have to check when I'm back. Oh, I, I, guys, right now I'm kind of in the asshole. I can't like, I, I'm, in, I'm in the colon. I can't just fucking check. Like, I'm pretty sure. Like I'm kind of busy in the, <laughs> of the appointment. <laughs> I'm in there, I can't just. You've never seen a parasite infection as bad as this. Biological waste bag that contains the extracted parasites undulates as it sits on your desk. The fisherman was shocked to see what came out of it. Maybe he'll cook his food from now on. Thursday, meat. What? No, no, no. Yes, the pain in my bowels is terrible. It is as if my bowels are getting excited at the prospect of more food and demand I eat. I hear something in my mind demanding more food, grips me from within and knows that I am in pain. The pain stops when I give it more food. It controls me. I cannot say I've ever encountered any symptoms like these in the medicine literature, but I can see you are suffering and I want it to stop. All right, let's get in there. Puts on latex suit. Climbs in. Here I go. I'm freaking crawling in prone, chat. I'm crawling in prone. All right. Ugh. What the? I got eyeballs on some kind of eyeball right now. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna deal with it the only way I- Oh, fuck, there's a whole colony of them. Dude, I'm getting- Do you wanna know what's the- I don't know, you know what? No, I'm not gonna say it's because of this game, but I am fucking hungry. I am hungry. Alright, I'm gonna be honest. And it's not because of the game. You are fucking disgusting. I can't control my tummy a rumbling and a grumbling. Okay, I can't control it. Are those little fingies? Oh, that's cute. Doing a damn good job dealing with all this. Eyeball, gone. Dude, this guy's got so many spare parts he's gonna be able to use later though, think about it. Like those fingers are still moving. Like they're still like squirming around. He's got spare parts for days, man. Perfectly trimmed. <laughs> Don't fucking say, why are you paying attention to that, you sick bastard? Got a lot to work through here, guys. Which Legend of Zelda is this? Good question. Damn, is he still playing this? He must really love ass. No, chat. I love saving lives while freaking neck deep in someone's asshole. All right, both of those things can be done together. You mean <laughs> you mean waist deep, dude? Only my freaking toes at this point are sticking out, man. I'm fully in there, crawling prone through the fucking trenches, trying to save this man's life. And the Michael B. Jordan. You know, if Michael B. Dude. <laughs> Yeah, they, they don't call me the Michael B. Jordan of colonoscopy, so I can just like fucking not like go all in 100% of the time. The the B stands for butthole. Michael B. Jordan is an actor. He's an actor. Jet, are both of them good? Like, does it matter which one? Like, what? Well, it's just Michael Jordan. Well, what if it? What if it's? But Michael B. Was it Michael B. Jordan in Space Jam? Isn't that the space? What's happening? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> who the hell am I? Been? <laughs> and who the hell have I been telling these? Who the hell have I been thinking? People have been calling me as a as a doctor. Michael B. Jordan is an American actor and director. What movies has he done? Because that brings it back to if I'm like, if it's like, cool or not. Oh, he did like. All right. Well, he's like, 
You did Creed? You did the Creed movies? Look, Chad, and that's great because I'm fighting for my fucking life in here. All right? I'm fighting for my goddamn life in here. I, it works with both. <laughs> He's the Creed of Colossus. <laughs> guys. Guys. <laughs> Scan? No, it's teeth, guys. Yeah, newsflash. It's more, it's teeth. These ones are sharp. A large inhuman tooth that is growing from the inside of the colon. Yeah, I mean, I could have told you that. What did Katie fucking say? I'm just so tired. I don't know about you guys, but I'd let a vampire all the way up here too. Katie, I need you to stop. I need you to stop. Why are you reading them? Why are you typing them? Why are you typing them? Holy shit. Why are you typing them? Boxing day is intense, Jesus. Guys, and that's why I'm the creed of colonoscopies, dude. Just like Creed, winning the big game. Winning the big boxing game. I'm just like the creed. <laughs> what a beautiful boxing day. We did it, guys. We we completely pulled out all the teeth. There's nothing left aside from that horrible creature up ahead. It appears to be a small version of our patient's head. It is growing from within his colon is demanding food. Right, that's it. That's it. We cut it up. See ya! Well, that's the small intestine. Looks like we saved the day. We did it, guys. We made it to Friday. Yeah, I bet tomorrow's gonna be a real good and easy day where nothing bad happens at all. I've mostly eaten soup the last week and peanuts. I work in the circus with elephants. I have access to a lot of peanuts. Are your bowel movements unusual? My bowel movements are perfectly normal as far as I can tell. I think I shall lube up my instruments and dive right in. <laughs> Puts on diving gear, puts on freaking fishbowl on head. All right, I'm going in. Be gentle. Always. R.I.P. the VOD. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. I think uh, this one may not be getting ads on YouTube. Dude, you gotta fucking bite him. You, got, you can't just have him like this. Guys. Dude really needs to eat the peanuts, like, all the way. Dude's eating, eating like an elephant. He's like, what do you, where do you learn it from? The fucking circus elephants, you moron? Remember when it was just an old lady who swallowed their wedding ring? <coughs> I remember. <coughs> oh, is that a house? Someone lives here. Someone lives here. <laughs> hey. Finally a checkpoint. We can use this place to rest before we move on. Finally. A door. Yep. God, I really wish I didn't choose this one time to climb completely inside this here tunnel to get this done the right way. God damn, I really wish I used the, like, camera tubes for this part. This is a spacious, like, very functional colon. Minus a couple of fangs. Do you have a clown in your asshole? <laughs> he, have, he has colon clown disease. Holy. Ah! Ah! Hey, put that down. Hey, fuck you. Oh, the clowns are ambunctious. All right, that's it. Saw stays out. Hey, come here. Come here, little guy. Hey, come here. Look, he's like losing teeth as fast as he's getting them. Dude, this is crazy. Focused on the task at hand. Looks like we're about to flank him. He's not looking at us right now. This is our chance. Saw's at the ready. I'm gonna lobotomize the fuck! Die, freak. No longer are you gonna get to do this! Saw at the ready! Die, you disgusting freak. Alright, I'm cool, I'm cool. Get the fuck out of here! Get the- you thought I was cool for a second? Yeah, right! Boom, idiot! This man needs to change his diet. Guys, this is why you don't eat peanuts. 
with the shells. You're gonna get clown disease. Hey, chill. Chill and die. That nose is gonna make a great trophy. Let's get all these worms out of here. Dude's got clown tummy, but there's nothing we can do about it. Once it gets to the small intestines, it's not my fucking job. How'd you go? A triumphant end to a challenging week. All of your patients went on to make a full recovery. The medical research community was thrilled with all of the data and specimens you provided them, but were deeply confused by ass clown disease. You live out the rest of your life in happiness. The end. Guys, I got a good ending. Oh, look, there was just a clown in some dude's ass, but it was okay. Guys, literally nothing bad happened to me. I just retired. All right, chat, I'm out of here. See you at the usual time tomorrow. Bye-bye.